Uh, thanks everyone for coming. Uh, I am, for those of you that don't know me, I am uh, Ashok Kumar. I am co-president of the Wireless Technology Forum. And my uh, co-president, Steve Bachman. Uh, are you in the room? Good. Uh, and we have a very active board that is supported, uh, uh, supporting the two of us. So uh, thank you all once again for uh, coming here this evening and joining us at the Wireless Technology Forum. Uh, we have a few announcements and then uh, we'll get going to the program. And uh, please put your uh, smartphones on silent mode. You're welcome to tweet. <laughs> and uh, first, thank yous to our annual association sponsors. Without whom, we will not be able to put all these great programs, uh, AT&T, Import, and Ericsson. And we also have an industry advocate partner who provides a lot of educational materials. And if you're on our website, you will see it. And that comes from GSMA. So thanks to all those folks for their annual support. We also have event sponsors for this event. And, and we have um, several companies that uh, support us on an event by event basis. And uh, thanks to uh, Baker Donaldson, uh, Digital Element, IBM, Windows Phone and Stone. And if any of you are from any of these companies, uh, please. Uh, I know uh, Mark is here from uh, Baker Donaldson. Uh, Abriana is here from Digital Element and uh, IBM. And Merrill is here from uh, Windows and uh, David Sargell from Stone. So thank you very much, all of you, for the event sponsorship. Uh, we have a few uh, announcements that we want to make about uh, organizations that we support and work with, we collaborate with. That's been part of our goal in the last uh, uh, year or two. So let me mention about those. And one, one I did forget that I want to go back to is to say hello and a quick hello to all those folks on the webcast. This is being webcast globally. And uh, the associations, let me start with actually uh, Mobile Monday. Uh, Bob McIntyre and Ed Pimentel have been involved in initiating that. And they meet every uh, Monday at Gordon Research at uh, Atlanta Midtown. And um, the next one is on July 7th at 7 p.m. The Wildest Forum is also supporting a major event in town which uh, showcases mobility in the Atlanta area. And that's September 23rd and 24th of Mobility Live, which the prime initiator of that is the Metro Atlanta Chamber of Commerce. We supported it last year, and we plan to support it through this year. And there's various tracks, there's five tracks, and when I get to the moderator introduction, I will mention a little bit about that too. And uh, there's also going to be a hackathon and you can find more details at the mobilitylive.org website. Another event that the Wireless Forum supports is South Wyatt, which used to be Digital Atlanta. That's October 6th through the 10th in Atlantic Station. And uh, there's several tracks over a period of time there, so you can check all the details out at South Wyatt uh, uh, Tonight's session topic is opportunities and challenges with uh, mobility at global enterprises. We always do a session related to enterprises. Uh, sometimes later in the year, sometimes a little earlier. But one of the challenges, as well as the opportunities that mobility has presented, so it becomes almost like a benchmark each year as we talk to many of these uh, global uh, corporations. And we really appreciate the support that we get from the Home Depot, IHG, UPS, and various other global organizations that uh, are willing to come up to speak to you folks as part of the Wild Spawn event. And tonight's moderator is uh, Hamish Caldwell. Uh, many of you that are, he's a mobility solutions and business executive. Many of you that have been familiar with uh, Wild Spawn probably have seen Hamish. Hamish has been one of the early supporters of the Wild Spawn being on the board and has moderated several sessions. Hamish is a mobile solutions and business executive with over 25 years of leadership 
experience creating, delivering, and growing high technology product and service businesses in the consumer as well as in the enterprise segments. Uh, currently, Himish is providing consulting and advisory services in the area of innovation, marketing, and product strategy, startups, and emerging businesses. Previously, Himish has been the Chief Marketing Officer and General Manager of the Enterprise Division of Information Software Technologies. And prior to that, from 2000 till 2013, he was the Executive Director of Marketing Product Management at uh, at and Business Solutions and Single Box. Hamish has an MS degree in Computer Science from Jewish Tech and an MS degree MS and MS degree in engineering from UC Berkeley and his undergraduate civil engineering degree from his hometown of Glasgow, UK. And you'll hear more about it now. Hamish, please come forward. Thank you very much, Ashok. Actually, I, I just occurs to me, it might not be ever again that you get to say Glasgow, UK, because you all got to watch the vote coming in September. We might get independence in Scotland, so it's the hot political topic of the day over there. Um, so it's a real pleasure to be with you this evening. And um, what we're going to do is I will uh, introduce our panelists who will come up and join us for a few minutes, uh, in a few minutes, and uh, then they'll tell you more about their particular focus areas these days in mobility. I will uh, maybe get the, kind of the ball rolling with a bit of questions and discussion, and uh, and then we will uh, and then we'll open up the floor. So and I, I think uh, many of you probably are regular attenders. I hope at WTF and know that the Q and A that you all participate in is really the high value part of the show. So please be thinking about those questions. Uh, anything's fair game. You'll ask a question. We, we don't have a mic, so I think it's a small enough room. We can hear it, but I'll make sure we repeat the question and, uh, and then we'll have the panelists answer. So with that, uh, let me just uh, let you know first, uh, I'll first just cover very briefly our panelists and then ask them to join me here on the, on the podium in a minute. Uh, so first, Matt Jones is General Manager of Mobility at Home Depot. Uh, needs no introduction as a brand and as a company, the global reach and the retail experience. And in his role, Matt is responsible for driving the mobile impact on the customer and the business. Uh, he'll tell you more about that in a second. Uh, but what I wanted to just tell you a little bit about is that he brings to that also past experience from the media world where he was at Gannett USA. So he brings multiple skill sets and consumer related experiences to his work. So Matt, we really appreciate you for joining us tonight. Next, Keith Credendino, the Vice President of Guest Solutions at the Intercontinental Hotel Group. And uh, Guest Solutions is a broad area, as you can imagine, in a franchise based hotel hospitality industry. Um, there's a, a wide, various, uh, wide variety of experiences to take into consideration. So, so Matt, uh, sorry, Keith has, a, has the broad view of that. Everything, before you even think you're going to go and stay in a hotel, and then you maybe go online, and then you call a call center, and then you go to a hotel, and then you use the internet, and then you go home, and then you use your rewards. Matt owns all of that, and more, I'm sure. And uh, Keith, sorry, my apologies. Uh, so Keith, uh, Keith will, uh, owns that whole spectrum of the guest solution and guest experience end to end. So thank you very much, Keith, for, for being here tonight. And then Rob Russell. Rob is the director of digital, social, and mobile at UPS, another key leading brand that needs no introduction. And as you know, has a global reach and is more than mobile uh, because they're on the move all the time. Uh, so in his role there is touching how social and mobile come together, but he brings to that years of experience from the carrier perspective, where uh, Rob was a marketing and product manager in at and business solutions world, so he understands the carrier play very well, and he knows about the mobile <coughs> marketing opportunities that he helped develop in that environment. Before that, he was involved in areas such as banking and finance from his days at Equifax. He's worked at AOL, 
And he brings also a mass market consumer perspective from being in the field as a brand manager with consumer product, group, uh, product uh, packaged goods and beverages in Latin America. Uh, although he's fluent in Portuguese, we've asked him to speak in English tonight. So, but the fact, thank you very much, Ro. Okay. And so, gentlemen, if I could ask you to please join me here on the stage.